Uh, let's see. Yeah, it's going to be a while before we can afford any of the really, really good things. Honestly, we might actually be able to just get some of them. Okay, do we have any of the really hard ones? The answer is no. Got some to give me money. 114. Yeah, let's, uh, let's keep doing those. And let's... I'm going to risk it. Let's grab the saw blade and do a run with the saw blade. And just see if I can roll melee for a little while. Oh. I'm going to do that. Oh, uh, let's cancel out of this for a second. Now, will this upgrade fist damage or melee damage? Because that's important. Okay, it's fist damage. So I'm interesting about if it, if the uh, the fist barrel or fist cannon or whatever it was, if that's actually like you fire fists, or if the fist damage bonus would apply to it. Because if that's the case, oh, that'd be lovely. I've got to figure out how to sell some of these at some point too. Oh, well. uh, let's see. Saw blade. Okay, so new gun. Saw blade. I'd be interested to see what like a multi saw blade setup would be like. Probably problematic. This might have been a mistake. No. No, it wasn't. Yes, it was. I mean, it's certainly fun. The main problem is the saw blade does not quite have the range that I'm looking for here. We need another gun to work with it. It's pretty good against the uh, the little turrets, and you can kind of you can kind of just cut through the lot of them. Uh, but you're better off just fisting. That's a shame. Cause yeah, uh, it almost feels like the saw blade should it extend. But yeah, that's it. I know, I know, I know how to get the saw blade launcher to actually not suck. But yeah, pretty much just fisting is going to work better. Okay, there's there's the multi jump. We we're pretty wounded going off in this. Um, no. What you need is the length, the long connector. Heavy energy stream. How much, how much money do I have? I got a bunch. Hmm. Let's grab the saw blade launcher. We're gonna need a gun. We're gonna need some health. Health. And we don't have anything else. Okay. So considering I'm committing to a meme build, let's commit to the meme build for a little while. I know I have a better gun, but whatever. But yeah, so if I had a really, really long connector uh, line, the saw blade would probably 100% be worth it. But on its own... Yeah, so that this is going to be a build I'll try again when we can bring a bunch of stuff with us on a run. Because if I can just bring, like, six things or more, then we can go nuts with uh, with lengthy lengthy connectors and have a really, really goofy meme, meme build. Okay, so let's, let's see if there's anything here. Yeah, pokey stick. Yeah, sure. I was gonna call it the, uh, the bushwhacker. Chainsaw on a stick! Okay, I don't see anything else here. Uh, let's see. Is this... I think this is the only exit. You can kind of hear the saw blades going in the background and it's just like, hmm. Okay. Okay, I'll give this thing some credit. It does actually have a very specifically, like, helpful use. Ow! Ugh. Yeah, I'll give I'll give credit where credit is due. I'm probably going to die if I keep trying to do that, though. Um, it is incredible at taking out uh, enemies from behind. Like, those guys are usually kind of a nuisance, because I just can't- I can't take them out. 
But, uh, the saw blade does actually take them out handily. Yeah, unfortunately, this is just kind of a bad setup. It's... It could be much better. Given the situation, but, eh, whatever. Okay, I think we got whatever. There's a... There's a battle room, there's that. What is this door? Oh. That's not an easy-to-find secret. I'll take the extra health. Let's go into the battle room. If I die, I die. Whatever. It's not the end of the world. Destroy no enemies for 20 seconds. Can do! Huh. <laughs> oh, that was stupid. All right. Oh, that actually is kind of rolling these things. I want to get a gun or two that have, like, a uh, hefty strike through or something. I've, I'm actually liking the portable pizza thrower. Portable pizza oven? I don't know. Bit of both. Okay, what else do we got around here? Secrets? Secrets? No secrets. No secrets. Just sad bot. Okay, there might be something up here. Looks like there might be something over there. Unfortunately, this thing has no kickback. Period. Makes it a little harder to... Oh, yeah, there's one. There we go, got it. Max health up. Alright, that's actually pretty helpful. What about over here? Unfortunately, we have jumps. We don't have much for jump height. Yeah, no. If there's any more, I'm not going to be able to get to it. Well, let's head, head for the uh, dice room. The only thing I don't like about the portable pizza thrower is there's a very, very low level, like, nee, and that's kind of a problem. Oh well. Okay, so fire. That enemies do fire damage? Or I'm not actually sure on that one. Well, let's hope it's just this guy for a little bit. Because, yeah, I can kind of avoid this guy's hits forever. As long as there's only one of them, I'm golden. Okay, so who else do we have? I don't see any enemies. Go up, probably? Yeah. Nah? I'm just confused. Oh, it's you. It's just taking him forever to get here. Jamming himself in a corner. Just hiding? Question mark? Come fight me, creature. I should probably escape. Abscond! Whee! There we go. Where are you? He's up there somewhere. Unfortunately, I don't think he's going to get killed by the grinders. God, the grinders look so cool. I love the industrial look to this level. The neon the neon level is cool, but maybe maybe part of it is we just haven't had the, uh, the time to like really get used to it. Alright, so we got a precision module. Hey, ooh, lava container. We want that for later reasons. Grab the connector, solid. Honestly, I think I might just grab the uh, triangle chain gun. Kind of switch this out. Because, yeah, unfortunately, the saw blades, it's too short range to actually be worth anything. We do have the heavy energy stream. You know, that could work. I haven't really messed with uh, modifiers yet, but a lava container uh, here. This this is a fun combo. I like lava mines everywhere. Works better on the regular chain gun just because. But I'll take what I can get. Actually, let's try it on the triangle chain gun instead of the heavy energy stream, just because trying to deal with gravity right now is not going to be easy if I'm tossing these all over the place. Uh, 
that's adequate. I'm not exactly feeling it, but this will be fine. Hello! I leave. Farewell. Can I just... Can I just leave? I don't think I've never checked. Yeah, you can just straight up... Just guts it past these. That's kind of really amusing, actually. I've never te I've never really tested that, because it, it just felt cheap. But yeah, I guess if you wanted to, you could just kind of leave. But yeah, it would just feel kind of unfair. Wait, do my fire mines hurt me now? They didn't previously, but they might now. I guess we'll have to we'll have to do a test. Because that's an important thing to find out before I go for a full fire mine build at some point. Because someday I'm going to do that. Also, it really doesn't feel like the fire mines are actually helping me as much as I'd like them to. Maybe they are. Uh, fire mines seem like... Yeah, no. I don't know. I'm trying to trying to see what the uh, specific damage numbers are, but I also kind of need to kill these guys. Okay. What happen happens if you put the lava module on the uh, the flamethrower? Okay, one of these has got to give me a fire mine, yeah. Yep. Oh, I hurt myself on those now. I don't think they used to. Not the demo, maybe? Yeah, so maybe if maybe if I get some of the upgrades, it could be worth it. I don't think there's anybody else in here. So those traps are just gonna keep going. Well that's fine. Uh let's see. Hey, what happened to the railgun? Uh, that was a previous run. Okay, I don't see anything in here. Oh, there's a secret up there. Am I going to be able to get to that? Um, if we had a shop, I could probably... With a heavy energy stream. No, I'm, I'm not getting any height there. Yeah, so there are some very Tower Tower of Gunsian style uh, style secrets. They're just rare. Oh, I'm fine with rare. Oh, unfortunately, I'm getting a little sleepy. This is what happens when I don't sleep much. Kind of puts me in a bad position. So I'm not I'm not really sold on the whole. Um, I'm not really sold on the whole. Lava mines. They'd probably be good on like a the small subset of, of builds. They'd probably be really good against stationary bosses. You know, people with a lot of health uh health where it like really just is justified. Um, but as it stands, it seems like they're more of a danger to me than anything else. Because I can just kill an enemy slightly slower and be fine. But leaving uh effectively impediments on the ground for me to damage myself off of just seems like a mistake. If I was immune to them, it wouldn't be bad at all. But it's supposed to be the uh, the trade-off. Okay, so we got something up there. Uh, do we have a shop? Did I... Do we got a dice room? Let's try bouncing off of this one. No. I do not have the distance on that. Alright, let, let's go down here. Maybe, maybe we'll have a shop down this direction. There it is. But yeah. Oh well. I mean, it was worth a worth a shot. I the one that's like really gonna be useful is the jelly mine. If we can get a really good jelly mine one at some point, that'd be good. So extra damage, but reduce speed. Could be interesting. Especially on like the machine gun. Okay, well let's let's It's tempting to pick that up. I want to keep grabbing the three arms. Those are necessary for the tall. Okay, and we're good. Okay, so let, let, let's get rid of this gun. It's, uh... It's not really doing what we need it to do. So... 
So let's just make something else. Okay, so we can do a blaster. Uh, rapid blaster. Triangle chain gun. And, you know, in retrospect, prove this. Attach. We're going to add the heavy energy stream at the top. Then we can do the rapid blaster. Okay. So this might be a little bit, um... Eh, it's not going to run out of ammo that fast. I'll call that close enough. And we got a battle room over here. Hell yeah. And the sticky mines seem better. Well, the purple ones are really good because they don't do damage. They stun enemies. Okay, this is going to be fun to fire. Take no damage for 60 seconds. Christ. I don't have a whole lot of confidence in this one. That was close. I mean, if I can kill these guns... I'm trying to avoid these, though I don't actually know if these are, these are lasers or what exactly. Because they never seem like they do damage to me. Okay, so we're safe. Get that EXP. I thought I was going to be in trouble here, but no, the answer is just kill everything, then you don't have to worry about it. Whoo, boy. Yeah, so the energy stream's a bit of a pain. I think I will only use energy stream if I've got, like, uh, some very specific mods. Otherwise, I'm probably just going to keep myself very satisfied with this. Alright, so we have these guys. This is a this is a tough battle room. You know, it'd actually be kind of neat if you could. Um, it'd be kind of neat if you could actually select what uh, what battle room you want, um, and it'll kind of like determine what your reward's gonna be. That'd be that'd be kind of a neat deal. So, like, if you wanted it, if you like saw your options, you could actually kind of pick. And then it's like, well, do I think I can survive without taking damage for, like, 60 seconds? The answer is, I don't know. Eek. A long room. Not exactly a good position for me to just be, uh, avoiding. Now, what do you guys think? Should I turn down the, uh, sound effects a little? They might be a little bit on the loud side, now that we're starting to, uh, jam on a bunch of extra guns. Let's see, will Mother Gunship have modding support? I think it kind of has m passive modding support. This is an Unreal Engine. I think it's Unreal Engine. Uh, so if, if you know how to, if you know how to mod Unreal Engine games, you're probably going to be able to, uh, to mod this game. Uh, let's see. Well, I guess there's no real reason why I should look for a shop, is there? I'll do it anyway. Oh, that's much better. It was kind of cacophonous earlier. I might turn it down one more. Uh, we'll see. Oh, there's a shop over there. Yeah, okay, let, let's turn it all the way down. Because, yeah, it is it is very loud on the, the, on the... Yeah, I think that'll be okay. All right, uh, let's see. Busy mini rockets, rocket launcher. Yeah, I don't think that, that side effect is, is tied to anything particular. I keep grabbing the connector three triangles, they're kind of fun. Yeah, I will admit, I actually don't care much for gun noises in games. Um, I'll keep I'll keep them on so I can hear them, but I'd actually prefer to listen to the music. Uh, cause the music in this game is real good. I feel personal pride in your achievements. That's how I justify to- Okay, so let's just ignore him. Who is pinging me on Discord? Probably Shell. More copyright related things. Thank you. It was getting dark in here. Okay, so I actually have some money this time around. So we could buy a purple chain gun. If we wanted to. That's actually kind of tempting. Cause honestly, saving up for one of these seems kind of... That's... This is a long way as off, and hopefully we can start getting them as mission rewards towards the end of the game. So let's uh, let's just save up for some purple guns here. And do we want to do? I was really I was really hoping we get some of the more. Uh, ooh, I could go for the jelly launcher here. Or we could just do low low orbit antics. So Doctor Simmons thinks that this ship houses a shield generator. Destroy it. Oh, try selling stuff. That's a good point. Let's see about that. Where would I do that? 
I don't actually know. It, it usually used to kind of max you out after a certain point. So we still have Area 5, Warning, and whatever this door is. I don't think that's that. Can I sell stuff at you? It should have been a really... Wait, is that a really shady Hugbot? Oh my god, it is a Hugbot in a trench coat. I think. Or not. I don't know, hard to tell. Okay. Oh, it's probably in here. We have our own crafting here. bench on board. Use it to experiment with your gun parts and try them out in the gun range. Just remember, you can only bring a few gun parts with you on any mission. It's because we gotta give those aliens some sort of chance. No, it's because of the weight limits and our infiltration torpedoes. Okay, so how do I sell stuff? Because they never actually really showed, like, a, a place where I could manage my inventory. Unless... No, this said portal. I thought there was something... Because that's the shooting range. Yeah, where do I manage my inventory? I'm kind of confused on that one, actually. Yeah, they moved it. Well, no. It was never in a location I could find. Alright, whatever. Uh, we'll deal with it later. I'm just gonna kind of hold, uh, hold on to that. Hold right. off on that for a while. I found a ship that fits the doctor's description. We'll work on finding the other generators while you take out this one. Okay, so energy burst is a bit of a mix. Uh, so we want to grab a chain gun. Let's grab two chain guns, and then some connectors. What do we think? Do a three arm. I'm gonna grab the three L. I've never. I don't, I don't even know what the three L does, unless. Hmm. I got stuff like the uh, power circuit. Or those crit chance pressure booster. Some of these could be kind of really interesting. But I think I'm going to leave them for later. Can you make a gun that just shoots down? Yes. All right, you know the drill, recruit. There's a shield generator somewhere on this ship. But the only thing we really care about is destroying the whole ship. Get to the core. Okay, so this is going to be my, um... This is going to be my chain, chain gun monster. Okay, and this will just be a rapid blaster. Let's put on the L shape. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, let's not put on the L shape. I'm not going to be able to use the L-shape even if I wanted to. Alright, uh, I should probably sit up a little bit. Wait, shoot a locked door to open it up? What? Huh. I haven't seen that before. Doesn't even make sense. I don't think we've run into a locked door yet. Okay. So to survive for 30 seconds should be easy enough, especially with this this firepower. Holy crap, I melt things. Yeah, this is this is why I needed to um this is why I needed to grind for a little bit. I killed everything. <laughs> oh nope, not done yet. It wasn't exactly ready for me, to be totally honest. That's that. Oh boy. Okay, so what do we got in here? Energy stream. Mm. I'm gonna try and be a little bit more picky, I think. Energy stream, energy burst, and a couple of connectors. I think I'm just gonna give that a hard pass. Okay, ba more battle rooms. Why not? I mean, Curious. what's the worst that can happen? I can see the recruits monitor feed and the headquarters video, and all sorts of other data. It's like I'm seeing everything at once. Stop looking at all my data feeds. This feels incredibly violating. Recruit, did you know that Jasper is monitoring the number of times you jump? That seems like strange information to record. For the record, does everyone appreciate the situation you all put me in here? Don't worry about them, Recruit. Just find that core and destroy the ship. 
Okay, don't use left hand gun for 20 seconds. That's easy enough. My right hand gun is just as good. Nope. I'll just kind of be back here. Dodging. Would have been bad if I all all gun if I gun like really really uh, heavy on one gun. But that's fine. All right, now we can just melt them. I will admit the double chain gun situation is significantly better than um than pretty much anything else. It is ridiculously powerful. Well, I'm gonna take a hit from that, but I want to get over here. Why did the wander cross the road? Because he had other shit to shoot. Hey, free stuff to grab. I'm just gonna hide in here. Wait, will they not follow me into secret rooms? Oh, that's that's an interesting one. Yeah, they can't <laughs> they can't get in here. Oh, that's that's neat. And give me that exp. Yeah, this is much easier now that I now that I've got the appro the appropriate uh, firepower. Uh, what is? Are are you guys the only ones left? Is that it? Are we done? Yeah, buddy. Well, we're almost done. We got a little bit more to go. Hello. I should probably look around a little bit. I should probably also look into my upgrades. This game looks like it's fun. Oh, it is fun. It, Tower of Guns, Mother Gunship will always be like two of my favorite games, period. Until they make whatever the next game is. Like, I'm really hoping, um, I'm really hoping this game does really well. Like, I was, I was always a little bit sad when I was, whoop, when I was, uh, looking at, thinking about, uh, Tower of Guns to some degree, because I always felt like it, it never got the attention it deserved. And I'm really, really hoping the Mother Gunship uh, gets the attention it deserves. Unfortunately, it's coming out the same week as. Uh, uh, unfortunately, it's coming out the same week as the new, uh, the new update for Gun uh, Enter the Gungeon, which could be competition. But hopefully, I mean, hopefully this game, uh, you know, kind of holds its own. There it is. That's the exit I was looking for. My olfactory senses seem to be broken. Also, everything tastes like tin. I'm pretty sure you're tasting me. Stop doing that. Fascinating. I must find a way to record this. Stop that. Just stop it. Okay. Hello. Yeah, I got I got some fire power now. Power now. Ooh. Okay, so I'm just gonna kind of gun it here, and we're good. Perfect. Ow, that was some damage. It was just a lot, lot to go off there. I was just like, eh, sometimes it's just best to gun for it. Levels still don't quite have some of the verticality that I remember, but eh, whatever. Some of them do. I'm just hoping we get to fight a boss at the end of this. I am ready for one. Oops, probably stay away from that. Alright, so we got another battle room or we got a dice room. You know, I like the battle rooms, they pay out really well, but I'm not actually, um... I'm not actually... having a whole lot of luck with those. Or, or, no, I'm not finding enough shops. But the thing is, I need a little bit more than just shops. I've only got three jumps to my name, and that's... actually kind of disconcerting. I need, uh... I need more jumps than what I got. Uh, let's see, do we have any other potential secrets around here? I think this lower section is secretless. I don't think there's enough space. Yeah, let's go for this and hopefully hey, we get the uh recruit. check out what I figured out how to do. Roses are red. Violets are blue. Your face looks like a cafeteria floor. I'm a doctor, not a poet. <laughs> uh, let's just kind of jump around you. I say you need more jumps, but then it just gives me the kind of insulting version where I have unlimited jumps here, but got to touch the floor. Well, you got anything cool for me? The answer is eh, kind of. Okay, more max energy. I'm going to be a I'm going to be a gun machine, but I'm not going to be a very jumpy gun machine here. Well, could be worse. It is non-stop, uh, non-stop battle rooms as far as the I can see. Uh, enter the Gungeon update next week. No, enter the Gungeon update on Thursday, I believe. Uh, unless it gets delayed or something. Remember, you're not the dumbest person in space. I'm in my living room. 
But you better hope that that dumber person doesn't die. Hey, who is messing with the caption system? <laughs> oh, I like this. Jasper doesn't have any Doctor, real friends. That. that system is meant to relay important messages. Everything I say is important, Cupcake. Challenge terminate security. So does that just kill everything? Oh, God. Well, there's no time limit on it, so I'm just going to assume run and gun. Yeah, there we go. Challenge kill everything. Terminate security sounds like a very fancy version of just go murder. Have fun. I like this doctor. Though I will admit I missed uh I missed the uh previous uh set of characters. You really don't hear much from the colonel or uh what's her face? Wow. I'm a terrible person. Uh you don't really hear much from them. Can I get a shop soon? I mean, I'm fine with the guns I got, but I wouldn't mind a shop or two. Terminate security again. Whoa, new enemy type. Roving shields. Okay, so you, you can take out the, uh... You can take out the, the floating shields. They just have a crap ton of HP. Now there's one. It's trying really hard to protect the other bot. But what it doesn't realize is that it's my real target. Okay, there we go. Okay, so I gotta lure this guy out to the center a little bit. If I don't, we're going to be in trouble. Please tell me there's a shop at the other side of this rainbow. Actually, we might be done after this one. Yeah, looks like we're done after this. Well, free money, I guess. Wow. That was a tough sucker. Alright, let's let's uh, let's go shopping, just in case there's anything interesting in here. Uh, let's see, I'll grab the rapid shotgun. I don't really want a heavy em energy stream. We want to grab this and a barrel barrel? What? Okay, yeah, sure. <laughs> what is a barrel barrel and why do I want it? Barrel, barrel, barrel. Okay. And I'm just going to put the energy stream on, uh, the rapid blaster on this one, just in case. So what are you? And... I like this gun. I'm going to grab that just in case, for some reason, it turns out this isn't the end. So we just fire explosive barrels. I assume it hurts real bad if I hit myself with it. Nope. I cannot hurt myself with that. It straight up is only the fire mines. Wow. Hey, we've leveled up. And eh, five out of eight find of it eh, five out of eight secrets. Cool. Alright, so now we can sell stuff. I don't really like the connector ovals. I don't even really like the connector two solids that much. I want the long. We we need as much long as we can possibly get. Okay, so barrels. So let's get rid of anything that's gray. Oh, good, they fixed it. I, I had, uh... So when we were playing this game, uh, during the preview and the beta and whatever, when selling stuff, it would reset you to the top. And I personally bitched at the, uh, the dev team being like, please fix. And they, they please fixed. Sweet. So you can have up to 100, 100 gun parts. That's actually pretty forgiving. Originally it was like 50 and that got kind of tight. Once you started getting, like, the better things. We'll only probably need two railguns. We're gonna get rid of anything that's gray, to be totally honest. Uh, I'm just not going to be using anything that's that's low tier after a certain point. We might lose some of the uh, unique upgrades, but they're just not worth it. Okay, so that actually gets us a bunch of money. I'll sell one more of these. So what's rolling lava do? Uh, it's Good effectively... Good recruit. Oh. Calculations indicate there are several more shield generators, though. We'll have to take them all out. Then we can destroy the mother gunship. Recruit, check this out. Look. I can open doors. Look. At. This. 
I can open and close doors. Woo! Hey, stop messing with my doors. And lights. I found the light controls. Leave my lights alone. Why? It's like the only thing to do around here. It's... Wait. What's this? Don't touch that. That's quarantine. Whoa, look at this stuff. This is wild. What is this? Ah, when can we get rid of this woman? Not the confetti machine. Hey, look what I found. An endless training mission. Stop messing around down there. Recruit, get to the mission control. We found the next shield generator. All right, so we've got endless mode. I don't know how endless mode works, though. But that's an attractive prospect. Um, because... Yeah, endless mode would make it so you you could potentially just uh, well maybe not go forever, but you could go for a while. Let's uh let's keep let's go back to boosting my secret de detection radius. Really, I just needed the extra movement speed for avoiding stuff. Ah, uh, let's see, yeah, thousand experience to level up. Okay, so we can get another rapid blaster. That's actually kind of an attractive prospect. Let's let's get it. These things are awesome. I enjoy using them. But yeah, so we've got an endless endless mission now. Let's take a look at it. Hey, look what I dug up. Looks like your boy Jasper there was hiding an endless training mission. I was not hiding it. It's dangerous. If you die in the endless mission, you're still dead. It's no reason not to explore, Cupcake. Okay. You will certainly perish in this endless simulation mission, but how far will you make it before you do? I like the idea of that. I might put it off for a little while. Hell, uh. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna have to do this side mission probably. I'm curious if we get rewards for endless mode. Because Tower of Guns had endless mode. The main the main question is just like, since this game has like this lengthy reward system of EXP and money and whatnot, can I use that for super farming? I don't know, but I want to go do the uh, flamethrower mission quick anyway I, I think I'm gonna let, let's do the flamethrower mission first I, we've got a lot of things to do Ooh, yeah we're starting to get some of the the better better things along the way okay launch, launch mission let's see how this oh are we gonna be on our own ship nope what is this okay Oh, bugs, of course. I thought it was, like, insects, but no, this is going to be interdasting. Alright, I got a flamethrower. Oh, this will be fun. I like the visual. All the glitchy stuff. God, I would love it if, uh, if these guys made, like, an EDF game. I, um... Okay. Do I have an objective, or am I just kind of going forever? Okay. Well, this is probably one of those where I want to... We got a bunch of these guys. I'm just going to toss fire at the... Oh, jeez. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. It's staplers as far as the eye can see. Flamethrower is doing a pretty good job of rolling them. Unfortunately... Oh, right. I've got a fist I can use. I kind of forgot about that crucial detail. I'm just going to kind of throw my fist this direction. We'll, we'll see how this goes. I'm not, I'm not sure if I'm looking for an exit or if I'm just fighting everything. I mean, hopefully it's not endless mode. Golden stapler. All right. Uh, let's see. This this looks promising. I don't. You can't pick up any new guns. Yeah. Okay. And we got spikes. We got spikes. We got ramps. We've got here. We got there. I'm just gonna keep wandering around. Eventually, we'll find an exit of some variety.
And I can hear them in the walls. Okay, so I can't I can't slow down too much. Oh, health upgrade. So that's a good sign. Oh jeez, there's a bunch of them. Oh boy. Oh boy. Well, this looks to be about as good of a room as any to fight like an endless horde of little stapletrons. Holy crap, that's a lot. I really wish they'd given us a slightly better flamethrower. Or, like, had a couple of rooms to just kind of mess with it. Because I'd love to have, like, bounce on this or something. Or just, like, a smidge of pushback. I want to see somebody who's bad at this game play it. Just to see how, how it would turn out. I bet I could actually look up, like, a number of things. I know somebody's going to be like, Wander, you're terrible at this game. Look at the mirror. They'd probably be wrong. I don't know. I've only died once. I got close once or twice. Is the level changing before your very eyes? Uh, no. So there, there's a definitive end. This is this is using old school design uh, mentality, as far as I can tell, where they they're effectively changing the level design just slightly, uh, so you can have like a, a vague idea of um, where to go next. I don't know if these guys spawn in based on, like, location, or, uh, I think it's probably location. This looks promising. Yep. Uh, hey. Got to the end. Perfect. Uh, nope. Maybe not. Yes, okay, we're good. That was easy. One more victory for the resistance. And not a scratch. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Well, that worked out well. But yeah, that was very OG Doom. Uh, where effectively, like, the level... The, like, color or the textures on the walls or whatever change a little bit every single time. Uh, to kind of let you know you're in a new area. It works out well. Okay, so... Do we want to do that? Sure, let's do that. I want the boom... I want to... I want to do a boom barrel run. Uh, so we want the... Oh... The barrel barrel. I wish this was alphabetical or family based or something. Oh well. 